Gren. It, it's strange because I think the player base is in a weird spot because they don't have great framework mm. because there aren't a lot of very good Grens out there. And just in general, like there isn't too much great content Ooh. out there for like developing a game plan in this game. Yeah. Um, but that character has so many options. Yeah, and so just like what you mentioned yeah. earlier, and it seems to me that this is going to be using Meta Knight off the bat, and Meta we're going to see the Lucina that everyone expects from Randy to play. I This matchup, I kind of like, it's like up and down to me, honestly. I think it's even, but on F, for some reason, on FD, F, Meta Knight shines on that stage in this oh, matchup. Yeah. Meta Knight just shines on FD in general. Once right. you have to interact <laughs> with the dash attack, things get a lot scarier. It's like, ah, oh, crap. Do yeah. I block? Or do I let go of shield? Yeah, you gotta play. It's in that like you playing on the ground. You're playing rock paper scissors nonstop in this matchup. Yeah. Say, so, all right, I'm gonna dash attack you 13 times. Now the, the 14th, I'm actually gonna grab Ooh, you. Ramy wow. with great corner pressure here, though. Scouting that shield out. Just a lot of great ledge trapping. Very well played for his stock here. Aceto looking to bring things back with that grab immediately. Finds the dash attack. Unfortunately, not finding the pressure off of it. Ramy. Ooh. Putting a setup back in the corner. I like the drag down setup that Aceto went for, but didn't I guess didn't space it correctly to the point where Rami just got out of it like it was nothing. Yeah. Ooh. Big dare. And Rami is moving right now. Yeah, absolutely. Like I saw him playing earlier in friendly, he's usually warming up real quick with um not BB, um Mono and everybody else. <laughs> and they, they was just going at Ooh. it before the bracket even started, so Oh, oh unfortunately, I've never doesn't seen get the stage Night playing. Metal. Yeah, it's just kind of weird positioning on PS2, and the camera made it a little bit difficult there. That it's also, said, yeah, it is, it's also just a one. very yeah. awkward positioning, too, because, like, recovering with Meta Knight's type B, nice. you kind of have to hit the stage and purposely jump yeah. using the animation. But great edge guard right there, nonetheless, at least taking a stop. Ooh, giving a message right there. Oh, the, the, the grab release set up? Oh, almost caught that down air. One frame active, though. It is going to be a little bit difficult to hit. Uh -oh. Gets that uh -oh. reset on uh -oh. the platform. Uh -oh. Big ladder here. Ooh, and and is going to okay. live after as well. Settle, like, Big I'm not no Randy, bro. I, yeah. got, I got setups. <laughs> I like the, I, I the side that zero to death. That was literally a zero to death right there from a, from a settle. Maybe another one? Reverse there. Oh, okay. nice. Up B out of the pressure from Rami. Yeah, just Rami recognizing was, the situation is a little bit too risky. Rami wants none of this right now. Rami, Rami knows they want to end this game fast now. You see, now you see the tempo dramatically change. Yeah, it started absolutely. off, Aceto started off very sloppy and slow and realized, you know what? Let me pick up the pace right here. Uh, gets the, the wrong hip hop, yeah. unfortunately. Sending into the map, but a lot of damage so far right there. But Rami going to hold on to this lead as hard as he can by playing a tight neutral. Rolls oh. with Aceto to center stage believe. using that down tilt. <laughs> Rami didn't believe that would have killed. <laughs> oh, oh ah, Seto didn't believe either. That also challenge that so many crazy smash. spots for but both gets of them. the jump read right there. What a panic from Rami and Seto taking full advantage of that. Yeah. That Ooh. match, that yeah, match that, is going to be edge, scary, really. unfortunately. <laughs> I mean, it, it's... When you lose a game like that, it could be a big blow mentally, right. for sure. I mean, especially you find that shield break first stock. You find the second stock so soon after right. you feel you like you're on no, top of the world. Because of that shield break setup, Rami going to take it. Money in the bag. Yep. Nah, okay. Yeah. And, the, and the SD recovery, too. Yeah. Good stuff from Aceto bringing that all the way back right there and capitalizing the mistakes that they caught on instantly right yeah. there. And we're going to run oh, into Battlefield. That ladder is so clean. Battlefield looking kind of sus against Meta Knight. I get the idea. You know, Lucina got some some cute strings with falling up air setups. But yeah. Meta Knight can easily just... What we just saw on P2. Yeah. And it wasn't even a third plat. Absolutely. So we I can see something very similar with the side platforms of Battlefield. But killing a little consistently. Yeah. It's going to be a little difficult um, to run this matchup, especially if Aceto is on point with the ladders. But I can understand the pick for... Oh, don't go to the stage! <laughs> ah! No, not the ledge! Yo, I not thought Rami ledge. caught the, 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 the ultimate jank where you could just hold jab forever. Oh, and yeah. And then Rami... So, yeah. I feel like Rami knew low-key that like, he double-rolled at the same spot. Yeah. Oh, what a force match right there. And an Very up well timed up beat. I'm yep. Meta Knight. I got mad jumps. I'm not scared. I'm not scared of not tag. Yeah. At least at that percent. Oh, what a roll. All right. We see a lot of pressure here. Rami just trying to use the bigger sword buttons. A big way to deal with Meta Knight is just press those buttons that are a lot bigger than his entire character because he is swinging a butter knife sometimes. But 
Aseto just playing at a range where it just makes it easier for him to react with dash attack. Oh, Papa, I don't know about that. Oh, that's going on. But it works in his favor anyway. Yeah. I was, gonna, I was just going to mention, I like the way how Rami adjusted that they st they started to stay more grounded. Mm. And because in the last game, Rami was just moving, jumping too many times, yeah. playing the way how Marcina would normally play. But now on Battlefield, recognizing that the way how game one didn't Ooh. go in his favor. Oh, big anti-air moment. That up smash oh. not connecting. Ooh. Oh, I like the attempt from was... Rami, but instead of just scouting <laughs> out the slow, drawn out return and calling it out with down B. Oh, oh no, oh, this, this is, is what we want to see here, Meta Knight fan. Bro. Oh, oh no, you died. Oh, oh, no, okay. you're not dead. Not enough okay, Rami's to him maybe yet. saving him almost, but I, I like, like it taking maybe. the damage. Oh, that was nice. Tries to call it the full hop, doesn't <laughs> quite get it. Rami doesn't find a rebuttal. All right, Great good. Nair. Not a lot of people know, but that button swings three times in front of Lucina, not twice. What do you mean, the counter? Uh, the neutral air. So neutral air swings hit one, and yeah. then there's a strong hit, but then there's another strong hit that comes out after that. So you're, telling me, you're trying to tell me if you go to training mode with Lucina's near, you're going to see three hits connect on in the, the front. counter? Uh, you're not going to see three <laughs> hits connect because the second one is too strong for it to connect into the third, yeah. but the third one does cover that space next to it. That is interesting. That was why we saw out. that rolling get caught <laughs> earlier. That all being said, Rami taking a lot of advantage here of, once again, the size Ooh. of these buttons, uh -oh. keeping a settle out, but this stock might only result in 36% of extra credit. We see the recovery coming from Aseto. Very nice, patient edge guard right there. Literally oh, no. waited till all of Rami's options were gone and capitalized on that stock right there. We oh, might see God. another robbery. Oh, Rami man. took the first stock yet. Oh, the oh, the routing That's was crazy. so clean. Just taking his time this. with it. it. Another robbery being committed nice. from Aceto right there. Yeah, that matchup can be difficult because, I mean, as good as Lucina's buttons are in the matchup, her weight and her fall speed are the perfect specs for Meta Knight yeah. to combo at times. The only reason why I would say the matchup is a little even is because, like, Meta Knight's aerial drift is kind of cheeks. Yeah. So it's like, you know, Lucina can kind of abuse it if Meta Knight's, like, on top of her. But if you're not getting Meta Knight in that position, you got to play a, a really honest neutral yeah. against this character. Like, okay. Rami, literally on both of those games, Rami had the first stock and thought he was feeling himself with moving around, being yep. cute, and then a settle robbed him on Absolutely. both of those games right there. A zero to death on game one of P2. And then almost another zero to death, but still manages to clean out his stocks. And that's oh, pretty much the differences right that we're going to see right here. That settle just capitalizing a bit harder. That mm. up air, you get Ooh. no oh, fast the, fall, yeah. no fast fall again, no fast fall again, and just fully Fair. commits to that ladder. That side case, if you will, more actually, like a bridge. <laughs> hey, actually, go back. Maybe yeah. I can go back to that. You can probably, we can see the DI all over. Yeah, he was, he gave him the best DI Meta Knight could have asked for. Yeah, absolutely. In this game, you can, for some odd reason, you can see the DI that your opponent is going. Yep. It's hard to notice it, but if you really like take your time, pause at the game, zooming in frame by, you can literally see yeah. the, 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 the DI direction that the person is going to go for. The move that made me learn it and start looking for it is Kazuya's Electric I Wind God it. Fist. That's what yep, everyone Because it freezes. It stays right there, <laughs> so you have time to visualize the line, and you at least get to see like just what the animation of the line looks like. Those yeah. little blue streaky lines that are mm -hmm. right there that kind of just show you exactly what their pathing is going to look it's like. It's kind of like that Ganon conversation we had uh, like uh, that the, like two sets ago. It's like uh, you get punched, yep. but it comes to the point where like you feel that power right there. Oh, but yeah. as Kazi is like, All right, I got a little cheat sheet. I can see where I'm about to go, but it's like, it's, it's like rock, paper, scissors because they also, like a high level Kazi will see that same thing too. Yes.